everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be reviewing Rina Kataira's second album Psycho no Shuchi. Before I get started, I want to remind you that this is simply my opinion on the album. We all have different thoughts on it and I would gladly read yours in the comment section down below. Rina Katahira is a singer that debuted back in 2013 and with this release she has now two albums up her sleeve. Psycho no Shuchi is an album that I found very solid. If you compare it to her first album, Amazing Sky, you can really feel the progress and improvements she has made over the last two years and I genuinely thought this album had more soul to it and more charisma as well. This album has a very candid aspect to it with a bit of a childlike innocence added in the mix. The melodies are very pop rock and I I have to say the fact that some live violence were added on some of the songs really made this album work even more for me. It's fresh and pure and simply lovely. The songs that didn't click with me are strangely the more upbeat ones, like songs like Party or Otona ni Narena Kute. I felt like Rina really shines a lot more on very slow and simple songs like Dare Moga or Dare ni Date Cinderella Story. And I like the fact that she really kept close to this throughout the entire album. It really made it incredibly enjoyable. Even if I enjoyed this album quite a lot, it's not really the kind of album that I will listen to all the time. I feel like I need to be in a certain state of mind or mood where I need to be relaxing and this album really brings the perfect amount of relaxation to make it quite enjoyable. It's pretty much an album that I love to listen to when the sun is out and life feels quite nice, if I can explain this way. In the end, I found Psycho no Shuchi to be a great step up for Rinaka Tsuhira, and this album is very delightful to listen to with a very nice and light breeze that makes it very relaxing and enjoyable, which is why I give it 4 stars. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to tell me what you think of this album in the comment section down below, and I'll see you next time.